Oh, I got three poke on mouse. That's good. Maybe he's gonna be a few seconds. Once again, I know a lot of people are probably confused as why I randomly started pick or started doing chickens for us now. It's pretty much because if you do a full clear and then you start pathing back down, you can do essentially a cheater level five if you get the crab and things, and it just lets you get to level five by going to chickens, then the krugs and resetting instead of having to run the krugs and then come back up the chickens. That just saves a bit of time. It is a little bit slower though, because obviously Kindred has a little bit of a not good clear, to say the least, especially level 1 AoE camps are not good for Kindred, because you don't really have much AoE. But you can still full clear by the time Crab spawns. got hurt oh dude no when, when it comes to welding required I, I get what you mean required but when it comes to welding dude no matter you could be a quote-unquote master or whatever you're gonna get burned doing the most basic things just because sometimes the slag like falls off in a weird way sometimes you're just doing overhead and things like it, things just happen that, that shit just happens no matter who you are you're gonna get burned welding If you can't accept, like, not you, like, in chat, but, like, if you want to weld and you, like, you think you're going to, like, not get burned or something, welding is not for you. Because you will 100% get burned. Yeah, I kind of messed up my clear a bit because I didn't use my smite originally. So I'm just going to grab it level 3. Sucks not to be level 4 and have those extra stats, but what can Chickens are always welcome here. Hey, that depends who cooks the chicken. Some some people cook chicken until it's like so dry to the point where it's just not even good. Depends who cooks the chicken. You're the people who like. There's people who undercook things like chicken, and you you obviously should never eat that. Then there's people who are like so afraid that the chicken's gonna be undercooked that they overcook the living fuck out of it, and yeah. It's, uh, it's not a good time to say as a least. And if you're that scared of overcooking your chicken, buy a fucking meat thermometer instead of just fucking making the world's dry, like driest chicken. Nobody wants to eat the fucking Sahara Desert when they're trying to have chicken. Just buy a meat thermometer. They're not that expensive. You can spend 20 bucks, I'm sure. So with gushers, not nah, further stuff your mom said, Kitty. All things great and small. Rushing to meet us again, I see. Makes you hungry. I'll think I'll get food. Oh, I don't know. Make your own decisions in life. 
Dream of cats and chickens. Don't tell Kitty to dream of cats. His name is Kitty Lickpart. He's gonna dream of licking the cat. Guys, can we not like run it down bot, please? All will know us in time. I hope this one has strong legs. might make dinner at almost seven in the morning look look all i'm saying sometimes breakfast for dinner is great and sometimes dinner for breakfast is great all right the fuck does it matter sometimes i want fucking eggs for bre for dinner sometimes for fucking breakfast i'm gonna fucking need a slice of pizza all right the fuck it depends whatever i'm feeling who doesn't care what time it is why do you Why did I just smite? Why did I just smite? Why did I just jungle diff myself? Why did I just jungle diff myself? Why did I just jungle diff myself? Look, look, my defense for the uh, the smite ult is um the the sun was in my eyes, I'm lagging, uh uh the, the freaking the, the um it was Kitty's fault. There's uh, ma uh cat hair on my mouse sensor. Pito. folks no right. for this takes practice oh i haven't said kindred isn't mechanical kindred is the most mechanical part about kindred is timing your ult everything about kindred is pretty much all targeted just mainly kiting that's not mechanical really other than just kites kiting skills which doesn't really apply to anything other than every champ in the game It really just depends on, like, you know, you just gotta practice. That's, like, the only thing there is. Practice. Fighting is difficult for you? Well, yeah, but that just takes practice. <laughs> that, that's what I'm saying, is stuff like that, it's not, it's like, Kindred's not like Lee and things who have 10 million combos and stuff who are, like, super mechanical champions. Kinder is just a very basic champion mechanically that just relies on kiting and you have to practice it. 
Delandry. Your E is a fucking targeted ability. Don't you start gaslighting me, chat. I will fucking fight you. Mark, I'll die. Oh, League is not an easy game. Compared to other MOBAs like Dota, sure, League is easy. Overall, as an actual game, League is fucking hard. MOBAs in general are hard games because MOBAs are fucking massive information dumps. And on top of that, you have to learn so many different interactions, items, champion abilities, stuff. Ovas are not easy by any means. Anybody who pretends they are is like straight fucking lying trying to sound cool. It's the same idiots who are like, <laughs> you're only only a low elo player could say Nasus or Garen was overpowered. Meanwhile, Nasus and Garen were so overpowered they were picked in pro play and had to get nerfed in high elo and shit. Like, the, the, anybody who pretends like MOBAs are easy, yeah. No. They're not easy, but it just takes a lot of fucking practice. But anybody can get good at well i you're ever sure some people won't be able to get like you know challenger level but like everybody can get decent in a game if they put in the time Fear makes the chase more fun. i should really go spend my gold i really need to finish trinity a lot of damage First, yeah, pretty much. When when you first like realize the amount of information you have to learn to play this game, it's insane. No, <laughs> oh, you moved out of the way, and then you die anyways. Why would you move out of the way? Kid? Fine, this is fine. It's not fine. It's fine. I got my turret that I wanted, so it's okay. Everything be a okay. Die for me, pet. They were already gonna die, and let's be real here. I'm worth gold. They're not. too much 15 years ago i don't think league is honestly too much like people make it out to be i think the biggest and again, this is my opinion like of whatever but like i think the biggest issue is just they don't have a proper tutorial for the game to teach people things no match for us. You are dear wolf. and also a lot of the league community nowadays because obviously newer players are going to end up in games with experienced players a lot of the league community has a really bad mentality towards newer players and also just a bad mentality towards certain roles in general like jungle to the point where it kind of makes the game really hard to learn for people in that regard and it's like it makes it like hard to learn what the right way to play is versus just whatever the salty community is salty about you know I honestly don't think League is too much. Because once you understand a certain level of basics, you can apply that to a lot of champions. You don't actually need to know exactly what every champion does or like all their stats. You can still play the game pretty good, reasonable. Right? But I also have the benefit of 
I hyper fixate on anything I want to learn, so when I wanted to learn League, I hyper fixated the living fuck out of it, so I got decent at it. I wouldn't even say I'm good at the game, but I got decent at the game. Guide for items. The only thing I'll say about a guide for items is be careful with things like item guides and stuff because a lot of items get buffed and nerfed and changed all the time and a lot of people don't update things like that and make it very outdated very quickly. You can't just blindly rely on one and hope that it's always accurate. It just doesn't work that way. Too many instances it doesn't. I had one health, that could have been really bad. Yeah, but not a lot of silver you're not wrong but you also have to remember a lot of people especially whether they're newer to the game or they don't play champions a lot of people don't know what items are good or like when they're good again look at half my chat who for some reason thinks that bork is an anti-tank item when it's literally countered by armor Could have just let me have the five minutes. Thank you. Like the amount of people who think collector is good. And yes, I'm all aware I'm building collector right now because I'm just doing it because I can. But it's actually a bad item and literally like mortal reminder would be better. But they don't really, or I don't really need to. And I just wanted to buy dirt. But like, there's there's so many instances of people don't actually know what's good and bad item wise and stuff or what items even do. To the point where they'll just build the same thing. Or the amount of people who, like, refuse to build things like fucking Tabby, even though Tabby are insane value. Like, 20% damage reduction for a pair of boots. Try to contest this. I don't think I can get this in time. I don't have smite. Oh, he's almost here. I get it. Oh, I do get it. Barely. This is auto base. Man. Dude, Abby are so fucking broken early game against auto base champions. Because again, it's like 20% damage reduction. And people don't understand that's a lot of damage early on when you don't do a lot of damage. Like, it's so strong. It's like whenever people lane against Trindamir, who pretty much all of his damage comes from autos, but they refuse to build like Tabby against him and they'll try to build something else. And it's just like, why not just build the item that counters? People just, they don't want to build the counter. Or like just another example, look at Kindred players right now. The insane amount of Kindred players who for some reason won't build fucking Trinity Force still, even though it literally does everything crack and does but better. You know what, 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 what like you know why would you build trinity force over kraken slayer think about it kraken slayer gives you a whole nine more ad which equates to a uh, 6.8 extra damage on your q and um 1.8 extra damage on your w and nine extra damage on your e why would you ever build trinity <laughs>
those who dread us grant us the most power. I will say one thing, even though Collector is a really bad item and it's still going to be a really bad item, like next patch, it, one of the good parts about Collector next patch is they're finally taking the fucking BF sword out of the build path again. It's been like four fucking months since they did that change and it was such a bad change. I'm glad that it's going back to a pickaxe. That's like the one good change about next patch. How do we go grab that mark? Plus Bramble and Frozen Heart. Yeah, I don't even know if Frozen Heart's actually really that good anymore because, like, they nerfed the armor on it pretty heavily. It's not giving 90 armor anymore. It doesn't give, like, 65 armor again. 75. Next time, I mean... The yes, sword is still gonna build an IE, which if you're going IE, like crypt builds, obviously you're gonna probably want an IE, but other than that, BF sword pretty much goes an IE, Bloodthirster, and I think Sojin builds out of it. On hit Kindred is much better currently than Crit Kindred is, and will probably be for a while. Don't tell the Kindred subreddit that though, or they're gonna get mad. I should have ulted for her, but I didn't want to. I did, that's genuinely the only reason I didn't want to ult her. The passive is still nice though. The passive on what? If you're talking about the passive on collector, passive on collector doesn't ever almost, like it almost never actually activates. Oh, on frozen heart? Oh, the attack speed slow? Yeah, I mean the attack speed slow is good. It's just, I don't know if it's good enough to warrant it over other items that like have other passives, like, you know, Randuin's against crit or just like Bramble for more armor plus the HP. Plus the reflect damage and the grievous. Like it's not bad. You're, you're not wrong. I just don't know if it warrants it anymore. Where I was looking at my items and I just spaced out and then I got dicked on. I genuinely was looking at my items. I looked at the map and I was like, oh fuck, he's on me. And then I died. Why the screen grave? Because I looked away. Genuinely because I looked away and spaced out. And I died to a Talon because I looked away. We are not dreams. We are the waking. I knew he was there. <laughs> I knew he was there, but I genuinely thought he was going to go check the fucking the Baron and not run the chickens. But I also genuinely looked away and was spaced out. Because I looked at the map and I was like, oh shit, wait. I kind of wish, like, like I'm supposed to be doing a crypto, this is making me think about good items. I kind of wish Collector was a better item, but I don't think it can ever be a better item in its current state. Because they don't like Lethality ADCs ever being strong, and every time ADC has a Lethality build, they nerf the ADC or they nerf Collector. So I, I kind of thought about this. I was like, I, I wonder if they took the Dirk out of Collector, but they put a Sheen on it, made it, like, 
And the reason I said that is because it still gives burst, and like champions like Lucian can still use the burst. And then it kind of gives spellcasters an option where if you want to go like a bursty spellcaster or like Ezreal who can go in the tier second, you could have like the Sheen in the burst from Collector then versus like, um, what is it called? Versus having like going Essence Reaver on like Sivir for perma mana sustain and perma wave clear for that kind of spellcaster, but an aggressive spellcaster could have an item like Collector without it giving the lethality that just kind of like nukes HP bars early on because of the armor pen and stuff. I wonder if that would make it more balanced because we're at the point where Collector gives 10 lethality and like it's the same amount of lethality as a Dirk. It's not a good item. So I kind of wonder if doing that because a lot of people also want the Sheen crit item back, but Riot seems to not want to change Essence Reaver back to being the Sheen crit item. I, w I wonder if that would work out. 